Warning, the following video contains strong language and gory scenes which may be unsuitable for young viewers. Previously on The Walking Dead. You say so. Oh, oh shit! I'm Clementine. This is my house. How about you help us clear the way and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. You slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? Dad, look at the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. You were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat again. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. Come on! Oh! I got you! No, 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 no! Get the fuck out of here! Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. Hey, what's going on, guys? Bravo here. And welcome to episode three of The Walking Dead. So yeah, you probably noticed the wall behind me is not red anymore and it's been stripped down. Well, we're repainting my room, so that's why it's like that. But yeah, let's get right into this. Right where we left off last time. Okay. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Then it is far enough. Climate clip. I can't remember anything about this game. It's been so long. Look! Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh no! Oh Fuck. shit! Oh! We're trapped! Oh no! Oh. Oh. risks like this and we can't just let people die either when I say that door stays shut no matter what I fucking mean it we don't know who these people are they could be dangerous worse they could have let them right to us where the hell is your humanity they would have died out there we have kids with yeah, us kids. I see one little girl What is it? I... I have to pee! I'd go out there again in a uh, second. I bet you would. You're a dumb, careless go. kid. Then just go! They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's, she's the, leader. the leader here. But it looks like she's losing control of her people. If you were in my shoes, you'd be the... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. Holy One of shit. Them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he, he wasn't. We have to end this now. You... Over my dead yeah. body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, no! Stop him! We, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, kick his ass. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone chill the fuck out! 
Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. Yeah, Lily, and you, shut up. Shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Yeah. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Was you go, man. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. No! Probably. Lee! What are, you, what are you doing? Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does... She won't. The first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll it's turn just a boy, fast. Mom. And then, there'll be three. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. No, we are not. Hit him, Kenny. Knock this guy out. Happily. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh man. What? <laughs> no! Let me try! Jesus! Oh, that was not a good point for life. Quietly get Stop falling! Stop falling! It's all you can do. Clementine! Come on and spam in this mu- I just spammed that button! Didn't do anything! I was clicking all over the place, nothing happened. Everybody down! Stay quiet! I don't want her to remember that I didn't save her. <laughs> They're gonna get his shot. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger face. That was Fucking stupid. Asshole. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Uh, yeah, uh, die you. Uh, Bastards. I told him to calm down. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. You just called me an asshole, and now you want me to save your dad. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep office. an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. That's a good idea. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here. Out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around town? You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Talkie. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Yeah. Now get Ooh, him she those didn't pills. Like that. She's confusing me right now, Lily. Sometimes she's like, you asshole, can it, bastard. She's a real bitch. And then other times she's just 
Yes, save my dad. I'll give you. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. Ducky. I know, hun. What the hell? Come on, the fuck. All right. Um. I don't know what to do. What to do? To do? To do? Box. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Nope, maybe not. Uh huh. Energy. Okay. I'll give that to you, Clementine. Cause you're so much, but here you go. Yeah. Thank you. Of course. So, what's that? I'm not good with PC controls. Another energy bar. Sweet. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Okay, now I feel bad. You're from here? You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. <laughs> yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Um, hi. I'm gonna get back to him. Okay. Sounds good. You're kind of boring. Oh, I don't want to talk to you Yeah? It was a crazy situation and you froze. Before, with that thing coming out of the bathroom? Uh, yeah. Just don't beat yourself up over it. We stick together and we'll be okay. That was annoying because I spammed like hell. I clicked it a bunch of times and nothing happened. We just man. need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. You are gonna have this edge, you It's not much. I but don't here. like you. I can't stand you. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet. But I just like Kenny. And Kenny likes me if I look after his kids, so. So am I. Photographs. I don't remember them very well. Don't remember who. I think this episode, like the last one, is going to be more about How Captain can I with Venom. those things out there? Is that his family? I mean, they're black. I'm not racist. Um. Easter egg hunt. Oh, I don't even know anymore. Uh, uh Doug. This one too. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Yeah, let's have a look around. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring him back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Awesome. This is getting more and more interesting. Jesus. That's a lot of zombies. He just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. 
TV still. Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, that's all I know. Don't want another dead cop incident. Hardware still. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Oh. That's kind of cool. It's a combination lock. Break the lock. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. What keys? Oh, the Broadhurst. Yeah, there's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Look at the one trapped over there. Better than the rest. Oh, oh shit! What? Do you know that guy? Mm. Could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? Mm. I think that's. I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. I think he said his last name was Everett, and I'm pretty sure that's Lee's last name. So. Could be anybody, you know. Oh, he's brother. He's rotting and it'll cheat up and. Shut up, Doc. I'm sorry, man. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. <sighs> really? It's not great. I'm probably going to be able to grab it anyway unless it's still Okay, let's go back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. Ha! <sighs> okay. Let's find something useful. The door here we could check out. What's the rest employees only a life? Alright. Oh, so annoying, she's so innocent. She doesn't I can't think about them in here. Wait a minute. When he was with a cop, I'm pretty sure he said his family owned a drugstore. This door leads to the back alley. This is his family's drugstore. Which <laughs> fits cute. Pants came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Yeah. How you doing? Okay. Talk to me, Glenn. Have you heard from Glenn? Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. Everyone, Everyone out there seem all right to you. Yeah, well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. I was scared. Yeah, I was far away. That lady saved me. I'm glad she did. Maybe stay closer next time, so you're not so far away. You're sorry. I'm gonna try. Good. Oh, you're so bad. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. 
I'm gonna keep looking around. It's not so bad, okay. they should have saved it. I don't know what what happened. Alan. Alan. It's that stick. It's a walking stick. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you wouldn't have. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. She was pretty swagalicious with that hat. Move this desk. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Oh, she sucks. Here yeah. We go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. How are you doing? Mm. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Yeah, it's gonna be okay. awesome. Here man. we go. <laughs> Constipated face. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Uh, let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it either. All right, little first. I'm actually not a massive football fan. I, mean, I don't mind playing FIFA, but I mean, real life football, I suck at it. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Oh. <sighs> I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. <sighs> Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. Oh, God. I'm not a bad guy. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ow! What? Oh, I hit... Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. The way the game looks and how it's like real life comic book, it looks so horrible when I'll they bleed. Find your uh, first aid kit, that's convenient. That's Lee, right on the left, I think, yeah. Find anything? Whoa! Come on, nowhere. Photo. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> I wouldn't put it like Did that. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. No. Sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. 
I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? <sighs> They'll find us. They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. But we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Okay. What's in this drawer? Pens and TV? It's the remote to my dad's TV. And there's a TV up there. Coincidence? I think not. That's what I figured. Well, they're turned on. They're just like, no connection. Pharmacy door. That's where we need to go. Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. He said zombie. He actually said zombie. He never said zombie. All oh, right, I still haven't given her the. Let's have a look at that finger. Still haven't given her the. Oh. Last it hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Take the plastic. Yes, please. Clue. Awesome. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Awesome. Lee? Yeah. You're not bad, right? I... Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. It's complicated. Sometimes things happen. Right? I don't want to lie to her, but I don't want to get scared and not trust them. me. Let's, uh, head back to the others. Feel like shit. I feel like shit. I don't know what. I don't know who to trust or what to do anymore. How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? We've got that picture now, so we should be able to prove. Let's that's have a look the, around. The guy okay. we need. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Okay, how are we gonna it do this? long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Oh yeah, the TV remote. Can turn the TV on. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. Wouldn't those you TVs have to be that? turned on? That to work. Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Oh yeah, because you could memorize those codes. Worked. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? It's got no problem, Joe. I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. 
really a, a light just turns on and two of them only two of them just take them off. Doc, you wanna get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. <sighs> yeah, the TV remote would on the lock. Yeah. Let's head back inside. Okay. Okay. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't be. What's up? Glenn. Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, oh, man, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of him. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. I didn't think anyone That's what you want to do. Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Okay. I think there's no point wasting any time. We should go right out. Controls are a bit weird. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. You ready to head out? You ready to head out? You got it. You? I wouldn't have asked you if I wasn't ready. Yeah. Let's go. Awesome. Trap you. Get down. Oh shit. That was sudden. Glenn. Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without yeah, you. Yeah, Glenn couldn't get a lady. it was you. Fine, let's go save Glenn's damsel in Darn distress. Okay. Where exactly are we? No, oh, there we are. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. 
So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Hello. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. No, no. So we got that one right there, close. Okay, run over here. I don't know how we're gonna break that window. The noise will distract me. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. <laughs> yeah, smother it. Oh. That was sick. It wouldn't really work, did it? Surely that wouldn't work. Why would it just be on the seat of the car? Uh, sparky thing. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Come in here. That was awesome! <laughs> I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. <clears throat> the spark plug. Of course something inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. I don't think that would work either. Would that really work? That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. So scared to do that. Oh, what are you doing? I clicked back. I spammed that button. I, I clicked it about ten times, and nothing happened. What do you want to do? Sorry. Well, I think we've been going long enough anyway. I think I'll just end it there and then 
carry on with this in the next episode. So thank you guys very much for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed and you want to see more Walking Dead. I really enjoy making these ser the series and uh, playing this game is a lot of fun. So leave a like if you want to see more and subscribe to stay posted with other videos. So peace out guys. See you next time. Bye.